When you're ready to take your business to the next level, landing pages can be a great tool to help you succeed. A landing page is a page on your website designed to direct your website visitors to take a specific action. The action could either be that you want to convert a visitor into a lead or warm them up to click through to another page. So if you're just getting started with building your landing pages, this video will help explain the benefits of why and when you should use landing pages. So let's get started. I like this quote from Andy Wen. A home page is for everybody, so it converts nobody. A landing page is not your home page. Oftentimes, many of my clients confuse home pages with landing pages. Check out my previous video here in which I discuss all the differences. So when should you use a landing page? As a rule, I would recommend three cases when you should always use landing pages. The first one, when you run any paid campaign. So whether it's Google ads or Facebook ads. Number second, when you want to generate leads via webinar signups, giveaways, quizzes, etc. Number third, and finally, when you want to sell a high ticket item. There are of course other objectives when you might want to use landing pages. I have a list of 13 landing page types that might help you to see which page is right for you. You can check out the video here. How long should be the landing page? So I'll start by saying it depends. It depends on the intent and the value of the product or service. So let's look at them separately. When the visitors from Google paid search type in their problem and want a solution, so generally speaking, in this case, they're already problem aware. Depending on whether they know there's a solution that exists, chances are if they like what they see, they will more likely work with you. So in this instance, a landing page could be relatively short. However, on the other hand, if we run a Facebook ad campaign and point visitors to a landing page, chances are they might not be even aware they have a problem. So in this instance, the page could be long as it needs to educate the customers before trying to present a solution or to sell to them. A similar strategy could apply if you're advertising on native advertising platforms like Taboola or Outbrain. Next up is value. If you're selling a $5 digital downloadable product, then you don't need a long form page to go through all the benefits, social proof, etc. as it doesn't require too much of selling. But compare that to a 5,000 pound consulting service. On this page, you would need to build up your credibility and trust so visitors can realize the value of the service you're offering. So in summary, if you have a low ticket item, you can get away with short and sweet landing pages. But for selling high ticket items, you need long form sales landing pages with all the bells and whistles. How can you get a landing page? If you already have a website, then you can use WordPress and there are quite a lot of plugins like Thrive Themes, SeedProd, which have landing page capabilities. However, if you're starting out, I would recommend landing page builder tool like Unbounce or Swipe Pages. Overall, I recommend using a landing page builder tool as it keeps your landing page separate from your main website, which helps in better maintainability. You can also buy and use templates from marketplaces like 99landingpages.com or themeforest.com. These templates are ready to use and need some customization. In case if you want a custom landing page, you can find freelancers on Upwork or reach out to agencies like apexure.com. That's it guys, I hope you got value from this video. Please check out my other videos here on YouTube by subscribing to my channel. I'm Vaseem Bashir and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.